This video will guide you on how to prepare UTP4 pair connection cables for Panasonic KXNS300 Smart Hybrid PBX. KXNS300 main unit equipped with 9 female RJ45 connectors, 3 connectors for 6 CO trunks, 1 connector for 2 digital extensions, and 5 connectors for 16 analog extensions. For CO trunks LCOT6, each RJ45 connector support 2 trunks, blue pair for port 1, used pin 1 and 2, orange pair for port 2, used pin 7 and 8, green and brown pair no used. Follow the sequence, 3 connectors provide 6 CO trunks. Terminate 4 pair connection cables on 10 pair disconnection module. The sequence is first blue pair for CO port 1, orange pair for CO port 2, second blue pair for CO port 3, second orange pair for CO port 4, and so on. For digital extension ports DLC2. The RJ45 connector support 2 extensions, blue pair for port 1, used pin 1 and 2 orange pair for port 2, used pin 3 and 6, green and brown pair no used. Terminate 4 pair connection cable on 10 pair disconnection module. The sequence is blue pair for digital extension port 1 and orange pair for digital extension port 2. For analog extension ports SLC16, first two connectors support two ports each, first cable, blue pair for port 1 used pin 1 and 2, orange pair for port 2 used pin 7 and 8 green and brown pair no used. Follow the same sequence for the second connector. Terminate 4 pair connection cables on 10 pair disconnection module. The sequence is first cable blue pair for analog extension port 1, orange pair for analog extension port 2, second cable blue pair for analog extension port 3, orange pair for analog extension port 4. Next 3 connectors for SLC16, each support 4 analog extension ports. Let's begin with the third connector, blue pair used pin 1 and 2 for port 5, orange pair used pin 3 and 6 for port 6, green pair used pin 4 and 5 for port 7, brown pair used pin 7 and 8 for port 8. Follow the same sequence for fourth and fifth connectors. Terminate four pair connection cables on 10 pair disconnection module. The color code sequence for the third cable begins with blue pair for port 5, orange pair for port 6, green pair for port 7, and brown pair for port 8. Follow the same sequence for fourth and fifth connectors. For 8 port digital expansion board DLC8. There is two RJ45 connectors, each connector support four extensions. First connector, blue pair for port 1 used pin 1 and 2. Orange pair for port 2 used pin 3 and 6, green pair for port 3 used pin 4 and 5, brown pair for port 4 used pin 7 and 8. Follow the same sequence for the second connector. For 8 port analog expansion board SLC8. There is two RJ45 connectors, each connector support four extensions. First connector, blue pair for port 1 used pin 1 and 2, orange pair for port 2 used pin 3 and 6, green pair for port 3 used pin 4 and 5, brown pair for port 4, used pin 7 and 8. Follow the same sequence for the second connector. KXNS320 expansion unit, equipped with 5 female RJ45 connectors, provides 16 analog extensions SLC16. On KXNS320 SLC16, first two connectors support two ports each, first cable, blue pair for port 1, used pin 1 and 2, orange pair for port 2, used pin 7 and 8, green and brown pair no used. Follow the same sequence for the second connector. Next three connectors for SLC16, each support four analog extension ports. Let's begin with the third connector, blue pair used pin 1 and 2 for port 5, orange pair used pin 3 and 6 for port 6, green pair used pin 4 and 5 for port 7, brown pair used pin 7 and 8 for port 8. Follow the same sequence for 4th and 5th connectors. For 16 port analog expansion board SLC16. There is 4 RJ45 connectors, each connector support 4 extensions. First connector, blue pair for port 1 used pin 1 and 2, orange pair for port 2 used pin 3 and 6, green pair for port 3 used pin 4 and 5, brown pair for port 4 used pin 7 and 8. Follow the same sequence for the second, third and fourth connector. 
Use RJ45 patch cord, connect EXPM port 1 of KXNS300 to EXPS of KXNS320 first expansion unit, EXPM port 2 to KXNS320 second expansion unit, and EXPM port 3 to EXPS of KXNS320 expansion unit. For further information and assistance, please contact FJT Communications Systems at 03-928-42577. If you like our video, don't forget to give a thumbs up, subscribe our channel and share to others.